Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to do camera movement in OpenTunes. So I've imported this background and I want the camera to pan around it. So this red box in the middle is our camera and I'm going to show you how to move it around and do many different movements throughout the timeline. So let's start by selecting this object that looks like a web a spider's web up there and uh, this is our movement button we can move around stuff like the background or whatever object is selected here but we don't want to move the background we want to move the camera so click on this tab and you will see camera 1 and this you can move around you can also go to this tab that says position and select rotation to rotate the camera and scale to zoom in or out so that's how to move the camera around for a start I'm going to put it at the very top of the screen and then when we try to move down here move the camera too so we move the camera down there and we have a basic movement animation although you can't see the keyframes they're there if you want to see the keyframes you'll have to go over to the, the effects window and click on camera here and then you'll see all of its uh, slight movements in the keyframes. I'm sorry, the dog won't keep his mouth shut while I'm trying to film. So, this is our first keyframe at frame 1 and our end keyframe at frame 73. But let's say that in the middle of this pan down we want to go a bit to the side. So let's select a frame around here and just move the camera over. Now let's see how it looks. The same rules apply to zooming in and out. So let's set it to scale and move to the end of this animation and zoom out. As you can see, this gets us off our background, so I'm going to put the camera up a little higher. So when we scale it, we need to set some keyframes. Let's set a keyframe here. Set you right click on the frame box and select set key. Then we can go down here and zoom out. And it will not affect the entire animation. So that's our basic camera movement. Let's render it and see how it looks. Alright, that is it for this tutorial. I hope this video is helpful to you. And uh, I, I'm a self-taught OpenTunes user, so hopefully my methods are not insane. But this works for me, and maybe it'll work for you. Thank you for watching, and uh, check out some of the other videos on my channel. And I will see you there.